How's it going? Charles Botenston, founder of Boston Properties International. Let's dive right into it. It's the mindset. You know, this is one of the things that a lot of people miss. They say, oh, okay, I'm ready. I'm ready. I have everything, Charles. Let's just put it on the market. This has happened multiple times. Each one's a little bit of a step. You're like, okay, you know what? I'm ready to sell. Then it's, I'm ready to sell. Let's put it on the market. And then you start getting offers and then it gets serious. That's when you say, okay, this is getting real. The biggest thing you have to understand is that you have to get your mindset right objectively, not subjectively. I understand you're the homeowner. I understand you're the one that bought it. Come from the buyer's point of view, which is so challenging. I completely understand. But the thing is, if you come subjectively and you're emotionally attached to it, it's gonna be a little bit of a challenge when people start making fun of the renovations in your kitchen or this area that your, your child you know, had their first steps or the home office area or the second bedroom or the view. And this is the thing. It's easy to say, yeah, I understand, Charles. Let's, let's continue with the video. I'm telling you right now, actually ingraining it and and then when it happens you're like oh okay maybe you're right charles maybe maybe it is a little bit emotional you have to get your mindset objectively prepared to receive criticism to have people show up late or to make fun of it you're going to get a ton of emails you get a ton of phone calls you have to be prepared to spend a ton of time random showings at 7 p.m at night 8 a.m in the morning you have to come home from work or during lunch or on sundays or on weekends it doesn't matter it's when the buyer wants to see the home you have to show it objectively and we're going to be talking about selling whatever the buyer wants is what you need to highlight. One of you, talk about the view. Even if you don't care about the view or the open floor plan, the renovations, or they want a gut renovated, you're gonna have people that they don't like anything. They hate your home, they hate everything about it, you get offended, and then you move that on to the next showing. The thing is, the next showing could be someone that actually really likes your home. Each showing is totally different. Get ready for no-shows, late shows, people that waste your time. You have to understand from the buyer's point of view, they wanna get the lowest price. So number one, past video, get everything prepared. Get your mind right, make sure you have the time, nights, weekends, daytime. Big time suck, especially when you start getting into the contract, you start getting into the finance phase, and then obviously for the board application. I hope that helps a little bit to get your mind right. I come from an objective point of view because I don't own the home. I don't have any interest in the home. I just represent the buyer or the seller. I hope this helps. I'll see you on the next one. And again, my name is Charles Botenston, founder of Botenston Properties International. Talk to you soon. Have a great day.